You may have thought that success is the result of achieving big goals and developing healthy habits to improve the quality of life. However, in the process, have you ever felt lost as challenges and disruptions constantly appear on the path you've chosen? Many of us dream of a wealthier life, better relationships, more friends, and countless joys. However, sometimes we find ourselves stuck in a sense of uncertainty, not knowing where to go. And that's when Stoic philosophy can illuminate our path. In today's video, we will introduce 10 timeless life lessons from Stoicism that can solve up to 93% of your problems. These lessons not only help you develop personally, but also bring peace and direction to your daily life. Let's explore these profound truths together and start turning challenges into opportunities in your life. Lesson number one, practice self-discipline. Autonomy is often seen as an essential foundation, enabling us to achieve our goals and lead a moral life. Meanwhile, self-discipline is the practice that cultivates this capability, allowing us to resist temptations, delay instant gratification, and focus on what truly matters. According to Stoic philosophy, daily choices contribute to shaping our habits and character. For instance, waking up early for regular exercise not only brings significant benefits to physical health, but also serves as a stepping stone to developing self-discipline, an indispensable factor in daily life. This not only enhances conscientiousness, but also reinforces consistency and resilience in work and relationships. On the other hand, limiting social media usage not only helps regain control of one's time, but also improves concentration and work efficiency. By eliminating distracting factors, you develop a clearer and more decisive mindset in life. To nurture autonomy, we must start by setting clear goals and breaking them down into manageable steps. Establishing a daily routine, prioritizing the most important tasks, and eliminating distractions. This action not only brings us closer to our goals, but also significantly improves our mental and physical well-being. Epictetus, a Stoic philosopher, once said, We cannot choose our external circumstances, but we can always choose how we respond to them. This statement emphasizes that self-discipline is not only about acting out of habit, but also about managing our reactions to life's challenges. Self-discipline is a challenging yet immensely rewarding journey. Are you ready to embark on this journey and make it a part of your daily life? Remember, every small step is important on the path to self-development and achieving inner peace. Lesson number two, practice gratitude. Gratitude is not only a good habit, but also a remedy for the soul. When practicing gratitude, we not only focus on what we have, but also reduce attention to shortcomings or difficulties in life. This is a powerful mindset shift that can improve mood, enhance resilience, and strengthen relationships. Expressing appreciation and valuing what you receive can take many forms, such as taking a moment to think about the small things in life that bring you joy and peace. Pausing to observe 
and appreciate the beauty of something or an event you encounter in daily life. Saying thank you to someone for the positive impact they have on your life. Doing something kind for others to show your gratitude. Gratitude is not only an awareness of the good things around us, but also an active acknowledgement and honoring of them. For example, a friend has helped you with an important project. Instead of just feeling lucky, write a sincere thank you note or tell them how much you appreciate their help. This action not only makes you feel better, but also deepens the relationship between two people. Another useful way to practice gratitude is to write a daily journal, recording three things you are grateful for each day. Whether it's a delicious meal, a meaningful conversation with a friend, or simply a rain-free day. This process helps us realize that no matter what the circumstances, there are always good things around us. Finally, when facing challenges, seek out the silver lining of the problem. For example, losing a job can be an opportunity to find a new job that you are truly passionate about. Optimism and the ability to find the positive in negative situations are essential aspects of practicing gratitude in the Stoic way. So, through nurturing gratitude, we not only improve our own lives, but also spread positivity to those around us. Therefore, through this lesson, record three things you are grateful for each day. Join the conversation in our comments section. We often hear about the power of taking back control. But really, how does this start? The answer lies in two words. Taking responsibility. When you accept and take responsibility for your life, you not only face reality, but also position yourself as the agent of change. This is an essential step in solving 93% of the problems you encounter. Lesson number three, take responsibility. The philosopher Epictetus once contemplated on life, stating, it's not what happens to you, but how you react to it that matters. This quote emphasizes that although we cannot control everything happening around us, we still can control our attitude and actions toward those events. By taking responsibility, we not only improve ourselves, but also enhance the world around us. When facing a problem, the important question to ask is, what can I do to improve this situation? Instead of blaming others or making excuses, we need to accept our role in creating or resolving the issue. This requires honesty with oneself and the courage to acknowledge one's shortcomings. Similarly in life, taking responsibility may involve admitting mistakes at work, apologizing for behavior that hurt others in relationships, or making healthier choices for one's physical well-being. By accepting that we are the architects of our own lives, you'll realize the power to shape your destiny. Thus, the concept of taking responsibility in Epictetus's philosophy is not only a personal challenge, but also opens a door for us to improve ourselves intellectually and emotionally. In this way, we not only overcome barriers, and difficulties in life, but also move closer to a meaningful and happy life. Have you ever felt lost in a storm of emotions? In those moments, emotional strength is not just about standing firm. It's the key to weathering the constant storms of life. 
we'll explore the important Stoic lesson on developing emotional strength, an indispensable skill to help you not only cope, but thrive in any circumstances. Lesson number four, develop emotional resilience. The ability to recover emotionally is not an innate trait, nor is it something that can be bought with money. Instead, it is a skill acquired through systematic training and unwavering patience. To build emotional resilience, an essential starting point is the practice of mindfulness and self-awareness. Observing our thoughts and emotions without judgment helps us respond appropriately rather than simply reacting instinctively. When faced with challenging situations, instead of letting negativity take over, we learn to embrace them as opportunities for growth, focusing on solutions rather than getting lost in the problem. A prime example of emotional resilience in history can be seen through the figure of Marcus Aurelius. Amidst times of war, disease and internal turmoil, he used journaling as a tool to maintain a calm and steadfast mindset. His notes, later compiled in the work Meditations, not only reflect profound reflections on life and ethics, but also serve as lessons on emotional control and awareness. Through these writings, Marcus Aurelius not only upheld his spirit in the face of challenges, but also shared with posterity how he managed fear, anger, and disappointment. His choice of acceptance and optimism helped him become not only a great emperor, but also an admired philosopher, demonstrating the true power of emotional resilience. We can learn from Marcus Aurelius by applying the same principle in our daily lives. Whether facing failure, loss, or personal challenges, maintaining a calm mindset and clear self-awareness will help us not only overcome difficulties, but also develop long-lasting inner strength. These ancient yet highly relevant lessons are invaluable in the modern world, where mental stability is constantly tested. We are curious to know what challenges have you faced and how did you overcome them to emerge stronger? We look forward to hearing inspiring stories from you. Lesson number five, maintain inner peace. Maintaining inner peace is akin to the art of walking on a tightrope. Each step is a new challenge. Every strong wind is a temptation to lose balance. But those who adhere to Stoicism understand that true strength lies in the ability to maintain a peaceful mind amidst the storms of life. Sustaining inner peace is not just a way of living. It's a journey of perseverance through fear, worry, and instability. According to the Stoic philosopher Marcus Aurelius, you have power over your mind, not outside events. Realize this, and you will find strength. His advice reminds us that while we cannot fully control every event that occurs around us, we always have the power to choose our response. Inner peace begins with awareness and acceptance. Acceptance is not surrender, but a deep understanding that everything has its order and all negative emotions are just passing clouds. When you are no longer bound by the control of emotions, you will find true freedom. Furthermore, practicing calmness helps us create a distance between ourselves and immediate reactions. This allows us to think more logically and make wiser decisions. For example, 
in a debate, Stoic often approach with a different attitude than typical emotion-based reactions. Instead of hastily responding, they take time to truly listen and understand what the other party is presenting. This patience allows them to carefully contemplate the content and context of the debate, thereby developing a thoughtful, rational and calm response. This not only helps them maintain composure and avoid getting caught up in heated arguments, but also demonstrates respect for the viewpoints of others. Moreover, through this approach, they can foster constructive dialogue where each side has the opportunity to better understand each other's positions and emotions. Ultimately, to truly achieve inner peace, we need to practice regularly. Just as a musician practices incessantly to perfect their skills, maintaining peace also requires perseverance, patience and focus. Through daily practice, we will become increasingly serene in every situation, bringing tranquility to both ourselves and those around us. In the journey of seeking inner peace, we often face significant challenges. Inner peace itself is not just a goal, but an ongoing process of struggle and progress. That's why I am very grateful for your support in following along halfway through today's video. Next, let's set ourselves a challenging goal by watching the upcoming lessons and turning them into an opportunity to experience the power within ourselves. Please continue to accompany me to explore more secrets of wisdom and Stoic philosophy. Lesson number six, embrace challenges. Accepting challenges is not only an act of courage, but also an invitation for us to grow and develop ourselves. When we embrace challenges, we not only build resilience, but also develop the mental strength necessary to overcome future difficulties. Instead of avoiding difficult situations, approach them with determination and curiosity. History serves not only as inspiration for great victories, but also as a treasury of relentless perseverance. Thomas Edison, one of the greatest inventors of the 20th century, embodies this philosophy. His quote, I have not failed. I've just found 10,000 ways that won't work. Not only reflects an optimistic attitude, but also illustrates an approach to problem solving based on learning from failure. Thomas Edison did not see unsuccessful attempts as dead ends, but as important stepping stones on the path to eventual success. With each experiment, he learned lessons, refined methods, and progressed further. This attitude applies not only to science, but also serves as a valuable lesson for anyone facing challenges. Failure is an integral part of the learning and development process. But how do we truly apply this lesson to everyday life? Ask yourself, when faced with a challenge, how do you usually react? Do you find yourself avoiding it, or do you plunge into it with determination and a desire for understanding? Marcus Aurelius, one of the great Stoic philosophers, wrote, The impediment to action advances action. What stands in the way becomes the way. This emphasizes that every challenge is an essential part of the journey to shaping who we are. We should view challenges not only as obstacles, but also as opportunities to expand skills and deepen understanding. Each time you overcome a challenge, you not only solve a problem, 
but also enhance your confidence and resilience. Reflect on how you face challenges every day. Can you see them as opportunities to improve yourself and your mental fortitude? This is the spirit of Stoic philosophy, not only teaching us how to overcome difficulties, but also guiding us to live a meaningful and fulfilling life. Remember that each challenge you overcome is not just a personal victory, but also a step forward in the deeper development of character and intellect. Lesson number seven, lead by example. The philosophy of Stoicism venerates the importance of ethical behavior and leadership through example. This principle emphasizes the significance of embodying the values we wish to see in others, thereby fostering positive change within families, communities, and work environments. In personal relationships, leading by example requires various actions to foster harmony and understanding. For instance, imagine a scenario where a family member is going through a difficult emotional period. Instead of hastily offering advice or solutions, embodying the principles of Stoic philosophy through leading by example may involve becoming a patient listener. By actively listening without judgment and demonstrating sincere empathy and understanding, we not only validate the other person's experience, but also set a standard for compassionate communication. Similarly, in the workplace, embodying the principles of leadership entails not only speaking about lofty principles, but also demonstrating specific actions that reflect integrity and professionalism. Consider a team project nearing a deadline amidst increasing tension. Instead of succumbing to competitive pressures or cost-cutting measures, a leader leads by seizing opportunities to promote ethical standards and team spirit. By embodying a diligent work ethic, prioritizing transparency and treating colleagues with respect, this leader fosters a culture of trust and mutual support within the team. The importance of leading by example lies in actions speaking louder than words. By consistently aligning our behavior to reflect the values we respect, we not only reinforce our integrity, but also inspire others to emulate similar behaviors. Stoic philosophy reminds us that true leadership stems from the sincerity of actions and becoming a source of inspiration and guidance for those around us. In everyone's life, there are moments of unavoidable pain and challenges, but through life storms, wisdom arises not only from experience, but also from deep reflection on our own experiences. Let's explore the next lesson of Stoic philosophy together, where we find enlightenment through reflecting on life's greatest achievements and failures. Lesson number eight, seek wisdom through reflection. Intelligence is not just the accumulation of knowledge, but also a profound understanding of oneself and the world around us. One of the most powerful ways to achieve this intelligence is through reflection, also known as seek wisdom through reflection. Marcus Aurelius, one of Rome's great philosopher emperors, wrote in his book Meditations, everything we hear is an opinion, not a fact. Everything we see is a perspective, not the truth. Through this, we understand the importance of accepting and reflecting on every experience in life as part of a continuous learning process. 
This underscores the necessity of developing a critical mind, always ready to consider and evaluate information from various perspectives. In doing so, we not only perceive the complexity of truth, but also avoid bias and prejudice. Ultimately, through careful listening and observation, we learn to approach situations and opinions more accurately and fairly. Reflection helps us not only to look back on what has happened, but also to question why it happened and what we can learn from it. Have you ever taken the time to reflect on your choices and their consequences? How do you apply those lessons to your daily life? So, you can start reflecting on the smallest issues in your daily life. Have you ever stopped and reflected on the cause of a conflict? What have you learned from a failure? Reflection is not just a process of finding faults or defining success, but also expanding our understanding of ourselves and how we interact with the world. When you reflect, you learn not only to change yourself, but also to become more enlightened in every action, leading to positive change in the community and life around you. That's why Stoicism teaches us not only how to live, but also how to live meaningfully. Lesson number nine, cultivate a growth mindset. Nurturing a stoic mindset isn't just about reading books or taking courses. It's more about your daily ability to adjust your behavior and attitude towards the various situations life presents. As Epictetus, one of the great stoic philosophers asserted it's not what happens to you, but how you react to it that matters. This statement still holds immense value today, emphasizing the crucial role of our reactions to life events. It underscores that it's not the circumstances themselves, but our attitudes and actions in response to those circumstances that truly make a difference. This is a powerful reminder of the power of agency, encouraging us not only to embrace challenges, but also to actively turn them into opportunities for personal growth. By accepting that every difficulty is a lesson, we begin to view the world through a hopeful and potential-filled lens, turning every challenge into a stepping stone for personal and spiritual progress. By embracing challenges as opportunities for learning and development, we start to see every event in life not as a barrier, but as a stepping stone to becoming stronger. When faced with failure or criticism, instead of being defensive, seek to embrace positive feedback as a reward for your continuous efforts. Just as the ancient Stoics wisely recognized, we are not shaped by difficult circumstances, but by how we respond to them. Every step forward, no matter how small, is part of the journey towards mastery and should be celebrated as a victory. Have you ever wondered if you're approaching challenges in the right way? It's time to adjust your mindset shifting from a mindset of doubt to one of acceptance that every difficulty brings an opportunity for personal development. Every day is a new opportunity for you to turn challenges into stepping stones for personal growth and spiritual freedom. Lesson number 10. Embrace simplicity. Start by simplifying your living space. Removing unnecessary items not only makes your space more spacious, but also helps your mind to be peaceful, easily focusing on meaningful tasks and relationships. 
Marcus Aurelius, one of the great Stoic philosophers, once said, very little is needed to make a happy life. This means that happiness doesn't come from material wealth, but from simplicity and the meaning of life. In addition, cutting down on commitments that don't align with your values is another important step. Have you ever felt trapped in activities or relationships that don't bring value to your life? Having the courage to say no and focusing on what truly matters will free you from unnecessary burdens and open up space for creativity and true happiness. Finally, reducing dependence on technology is also a key factor in simplifying life. In the age of smartphones and social media, we easily get lost in a whirlwind of information and virtual interactions. By limiting the time spent on these devices, you not only give yourself more time for outdoor activities, reading books, or simply sitting in meditation and contemplation, but also contribute to nurturing a peaceful soul and a fulfilling life. So, ask yourself, what are you holding on to that truly enriches your life or just adds unnecessary weight? And are you willing to give up habits and unnecessary items to move towards a simpler, more peaceful and happier future? Simple living is not just a choice, but a way of life a path that brings us closer to the true essence of life and of ourselves. We've just explored 10 life lessons from Stoic philosophy together, each lesson holding the power to transform your life. However, profound change only begins when you apply these principles to every moment of your life. Ask yourself, are you ready to take responsibility for your life? Are you truly willing to face challenges and develop yourself every day? In the journey of self-control and self-improvement, cultivating discipline, developing your mindset and maintaining inner peace will be the keys to overcoming most of the challenges you encounter. And equally important, Remember to take time to reflect and appreciate what you have. Simplicity and gratitude will be an endless source of inspiration for your soul. Share your thoughts in the comments. Which lesson resonates with you the most? How will you start applying that lesson to your life? Don't hesitate to share your story as each sharing is a motivation for us to progress together. And if you find these shares helpful, please like and share this video with your friends and family. Subscribe to the channel to not miss the latest videos from us where we build a strong community together, ready to face and overcome life's challenges. Thank you for spending time with us today. Keep growing and maturing every day. Continue supporting us by watching the next videos displayed at the end of this video. See you again in the next videos.